Sally down to Mapsa. Hold. Come. to the Saligao market place. We just crossed the Saligao junction and now we are passing by the Saligao market place. To our left is the market this is about a kilometer from, from where, where I am based. This is a Salika market. Morning busy. But a fish, a fish market, very small fish market. It used to be bigger at one stage. This is the continuation of the Salika market. Bobo's in. There since I was like 7 years old. And now we are going to bang into these buses. We are reaching the end of the village. To our right is Dr. Wilfred Bissuda's house, the late chief minister of Goa. I need to change gears. Okay. This is a flat road, so it should be better. I think what's this? Um, uh, is the harvest coming home or what? Yeah, probably. So the harvest is coming home. And uh, this is the end of the village. The road to the left goes to Grand Marod. Grand Marod is another part of Sadigam. And after that, and Arpora and those kind of places. Waiting for the harvest here. My right is Monte Giri. Okay, they are still harvesting the fields. So it's a month of uh, October, October 2021. We've had a bit of a late monsoon. 
so the field the harvest is just coming in the fields here tend to be better planted than the ones next to next on the on the upper end of the village I have to do a lot of juggling because uh, the camera is in my hand, so it's a bit unhealthy, unsafe. More, more paddy fields, harvesting on both sides. At one stage we would go cycling on this road to school, which is about 6.3 kilometers. Pleasant ride, pleasant ride, especially early in the morning, but when you are coming home, the, in the hot afternoon sun with the wind blowing against you and you are like uh, 13 or 14 years old it's, it's a bit of a challenge but great fun some of the houses built in the fields and things like that because the government won't uphold the law and uh, will will will, uh, will cut corners if you are politically connected so elections are coming up shortly in Goa and uh, this party from West Bengal called the Trinamool Congress is trying to make a big flag with the help of some newspaper groups and things like that, managing it. So this road goes into Para, into the village of Para. And of course we need a junction there which also takes you into Para and Agua and all that. left and our right, we are almost reaching Para, we are, we are in Para actually, we are reaching the market of Para, to our left and to our right are two kind of uh, wedding halls, dance halls, there are a lot of public functions, wedding dances, Alba Mask and Alba Mask. I hope the recording is clear, the first time I am doing it from a bike. So we are reaching the Para Junction. I've seen two accidents take place here. Both buses from from both sides trying to race each other and uh, just banging into each other at the end. We'll take it a bit easier. You can focus on the side like that. Padra Market, Padra Market. To our left, the road goes into the village, into the village of Padra. Very scenic road. A lot of Hindi films shot here. And now in the Padra Market. I get my best time. There's another video on that. It's been this way for ages, except that the road has got wider and uh, there's more building on the roadside. Some of the houses reflecting the diaspora expat affluence goes into the village. Because we grew up in these areas, we know we know these areas like pretty well. It's real fun to cycle down there. We don't want to bang into this guy. Right side. Okay, so my friend's house which was built in the shape of a ship. Uh, it's built in the shape of a ship, not Kaza Marcus, but the next one. 
the ship shape is not so visible nowadays because of the extension maybe on the top of it but uh, earlier it was printing press ahead. I always, uh, as, a, as a student in school, I always look at it. I don't know why. It attracted me. It's an old building, very scenic building. I'll show it to you in a moment. Coming up here. It makes for great pictures because it's so old, so old world. Oh, it's not a printing press anymore. It's an house. used to be a printing press. I think Mapsa is a very, uh, very kind of uh, untidy city. And uh, the buildings have not been painted for years for decades, many of them, as we go into it, you'll see. These are some of the new buildings at the roadside. So, actually in the field. It's a bit of a risky place here because a couple of my friends met with accidents on this very road. I don't know, everyone is in a hurry to, to, to get to town. So, a small chapel by the roadside. Ahead we come across the big uh, Bodhisattva temple, which has its festival once, once a year, in the month of, uh, around the month of January. And it uh, goes on through the night, so buses fly through the night at that time of the year. So people selling plants and uh, plastic. We need a plastic bucket. There's a speed breaker ahead. Oh, oh. That that road behind us to the left goes into Verla. These are some of the ugly structures that have come out come, come up on the heart on the on the outskirts of town. So this was all street area. So whoever whoever took over this area, I mean the politicians who made those few crucial uh, digit changes in the rules of the of the paper made actually a huge city. So this is again the section which I mentioned for both this and uh, better to avoid. Do you have something here at Babaji no, to take? No. To take? No. Huh? No. You cannot cut in here. You cannot cut in here. You go right now. Cut it too, no? That's my friend. He's open. He's open at this time. Packaging is on. Huh? It's still on. Yeah, I know it's on. Right. Okay. This is Mapsa police station. 
Ali and old building till I hear also above. What is Sanjay Apu? Hold it tight, there are two bumps in the road. I think, yeah, this is, this is allowed. This is not a one way street. So, this is the old part of Maksha. More residential, we are going off the market area to take the road up to the, up to the loop. Not the first ride, but the second, second ride. Correct, it says one way here. So we go along the one-way road. I think the cops are there to, to catch hold of students. The cops are there to catch hold of students in the uh, I just need to take my gear, sorry. Oops. We've got to constantly keep changing gears on this road because it's a very steep track. Pump. Then make sure you don't bang into anyone coming in from a cross road. Oops, 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 oops. Yeah. So it's a very steep climb. My friend William the drummer lives somewhere here. I need to change my gear. Twenty twenty-five minutes. Twenty-five minutes drive. Pleasant drive on most days. On most days, we are not running into the into the rush hour. Of course, it's the pandemic season now as well. But still, what's the watering? Now we've almost reached the college. We are at the top of the hill and we go a little bit higher we reach the college. At which point it will block us. I guess. At which point it will block us. But we can still uh, carry on a bit up more. And see, see how far can go. Just hold it to look up into my head. Or if you want to go there and get it. Yeah, that's the max. I guess we can't go beyond this. We should not go beyond this. So we've reached here. Finally, actually surprising we've reached. Huh? Just a minute. 